as I said in my last video, Intel Nail is 12th gen CPUs. Now we have one of the most powerful Intel laptops here. Let's get to the review. We would really appreciate it if you consider subscribing to our channel and like this video below here. Asus ROG SRX SCAR17 or G733ZW is one of the well-made laptops here. It has plastic and metal frame body. I like the aesthetics of this laptop and I really appreciate the design here Asus made. Typing on the keyboard is fine and pleasant and also it has a numpad which is good. The trackpad is fine but I prefer much bigger trackpad for a 17 inch laptop. This model right here has a perky RGB keyboard and I really love this design here. There's a light bar underneath the laptop and you can customize it using Armory Crate ASUS software. Also, you can save your data and RGB on this keystone here and use it on the laptop to save your RGB profiles. It is so cool. The chassis is pretty solid and there is no flex with the hinge and I think it's durable enough for its size. There is two USB 3.1 Gen 1 USB ports here. I hate this naming on USB. Please, please fix this naming. I swear to God, please. And there is two USB Type-C on the back. One of them is USB 3.2 Gen 2 and one of them is Thunderbolt 4. We have one RJ45 internet jack and one other uh, HDMI 2.1 uh, which is very nice and both of the Type-C ports support uh, DisplayPort 1.4. Uh, I really like the port on this laptop, but I, but I prefer one more USB type A ports. I really want three. I had problem with uh, copying my data from my hard, hard drives and uh, this was because I don't have enough USB ports. Please fix this ASUS. And there is one AC port on the back for power brake. Uh, it can charge this laptop at 280 watts and I think it's enough for 3070 Ti on this laptop but for the higher model with 3080 Ti I think it's not enough the screen is one of the most beautiful things about this laptop uh, I really like working with this 2K 240Hz display uh, I really appreciate what Asus done with, with this laptop I may like it for 18 inch display, I know there is no 18 inch display but I really want much a smaller bezel on the bottom but it's fine uh, and there is no webcam on top of the screen, I hate it, I hate to say it but there is no webcam on this laptop and you should buy one or buy a full pack from Asus to have an external webcam inside. There is almost 100% DCI-P3 color gamut. Asus said it's 100% but I really think it's 90 to 100 something like 90-50% but it's fine I really like the colors on this laptop and it's perfect for gaming and also content creation. On the performance side there is a Core i9 12900H Intel CPU and 3070 Ti GPU from Nvidia with 8GB of VRAM and I really like I really like the performance from this laptop. And there is also a 16 gigabyte of DDR5 memory with 4800 MHz speed, which is really fast. Also, there is an one terabyte PCIe Gen 4 SSD with all, almost seven gigabytes read and uh, almost five gigabyte write. And I think it's one of the most uh, fastest SSDs in the market. It's Samsung SSD. One of the best things about this laptop is there is two a slot for RAM for upgrade and there is two slots for SSD to upgrade and I really appreciate this and you can also upgrade your Wi-Fi card and I don't think you need to upgrade it because it's really fast I really like this it is Wi-Fi 6e and it works perfectly fine I tested Valorant, Halo Infinite and uh, Apex Legends on this laptop for a composition of a CPU and GPU heavy test. Uh, in Valorant with CPU heavy test, I got almost 500 FPS in the game, 
which is really good and I got uh, something between 300 to 500 FPS almost 350 FPS and I really enjoyed gaming Valorant on this laptop and in Apex Legends I got up to 150-60 FPS in game almost 150-160 but in average I got 120-130 in 2K resolution and it was really fine I really enjoyed I got championships I got best result in my Apex 7 kills uh, 4 assists I blow everyone away in Apex Legends I really love that and finally in Halo Infinite I got uh, almost 100 FPS in game uh, there is nothing to say about it it's on average 100 and it was really fine there is no jitter there is no lag and I got one of the best results in Halo 2 like Apex for content creation uh, I got my best results in Adobe Premiere and Adobe After Effects I exported one of my projects on our Persian channel uh, in 1 minute and uh, almost 20 seconds uh, which was the best result I got among the other laptops and uh, it was really fine it was a 4K 10 minutes uh, video with uh, wrap stabilizer in Premiere and I really like the performance on 12 laptops it was almost 20% faster than Ryzen and last gen Intel laptops after all I can really recommend this laptop uh, this is one of the most powerful laptops with really good design really good build quality and there is nothing to say except the webcam I wanted a webcam on the laptop really I don't have webcam on my laptop and this is a pain in the thanks for watching if you like this video please subscribe to our channel like this video give us a thumbs up and turn on the bell icon for the next video I'll see you around in the next video we'll see you around on this next video on the next video or in the next video. I'll see you around. I'll see you I'll see you around.